All right, hey guys, this is Nathan Connor, and I am putting together a, a video series about online business model design, particularly for people who um, maybe in network marketing, internet marketing, or any type of affiliate marketing, uh, you can have your own product, you can sell somebody else's product. Doesn't really matter. The what I wanted to talk about was the business model design, um, and the different factors that you need to take into account in order to run a successful internet marketing business. So uh, basically what I wanted to go into was the marketing funnel. Uh, you first, like the first job, um, first step is to drive traffic um, and that can be done through advertising and that can be done through um, posting content on the website where it can be accessible to people who are looking for in, in, information on a particular topic and that traffic needs to lead to the landing page some type of a this landing page is what they sometimes call it um, can also be called a splash page um, it needs to have some type of a unique offer in exchange for their contact information at minimum it needs to have it need to, it needs to ask for an email at least um, so when you get that traffic to the landing page and they opt in, it's going to redirect them to the download page and also the sales page. And uh, which, in, in which case, they get the free download, but they may or may not actually buy the product that you recommend from them right away. In fact, most people don't do that. So, and that's okay. Um, that's why when they enter their information in you're going to start a follow-up campaign and that is normally um, an email sequence of email messages that build rapport talk about who you are make them uh, comfortable listening to you and uh, so that they'll see you as an expert and also you can also call your leads or you can hire somebody else to call those leads for you so that way you can enter, like, basically answer any questions that they have and then close them into whatever uh, deal you have, product you have, whatever, um, depending on the business, of course. And so after the sales page, you want to continue with uh, upsells and cross sells. And if you are in a program that is like a continuity program, a membership site, What's nice about that is you make the sale once and it continues over and over again until they uh, stop the membership, of course, or they quit or something like that. But it's nice about that is it builds and builds and builds over time and it's what's called residual income. So basically, uh, the biggest thing to remember here, and this is probably one of my shortest videos, with all that that you saw that was basically what they call the marketing funnel and how every successful internet marketing business works goes by that design so make sure that you keep these things in mind job number one is to drive traffic to your landing page and that's done through promotion so if you're an affiliate marketer you don't need to really worry about the rest of the sales funnel because most likely it's all done it, it should convert all by itself it, that's what affiliate marketing is you're, you're just your only focus is to drive the traffic and the and job number two is to build a relationship with your list you need to email them about three times a week on average uh, send them a personal email just to talk about things that might help them build their business or uh, whatever your business is some, something that can just help them like maybe information um, on a particular product uh, like a product review um, some tips and pointers to help them reach a particular thing in their life like a goal um, a lot of different topics but just you want to build a relationship because what you'll find is you drive all the traffic to your landing page and you capture all, all these people's information but not everybody's going to buy from you right, right away now some people will buy from you right, right away that is definitely true but you can convert 
you can increase your conversions by about four times their normal rate by keeping in contact and maintaining a follow-up campaign with them, active and passive. The, if you do both, it's better, but some people do passive, some people do active. Both is best. So uh, I hope you found this video insightful and valuable. If you have any questions, um, feel free to comment in, in, the, in the comment section below. So peace out.